Today we're going to talk about two quick ways to kill cicada killers and ground wasps. Cicada killers are large red wasps that take cicadas out of the trees and kill them and drag them down into the holes that they make in your flower beds. They're very easy to spot because they throw out a lot of dirt and they are usually right around a plant or deep in your flower beds where there's the most mulch and the most worked dirt. They're not super dangerous and they're not super aggressive unless you're working where they are, which in your flower bed is where you're working. That's the problem. The first way we kill cicada killers and other ground wasps is with a duster like this and we use tempo dust in this particular one. You can see I have a long extension so I can reach down into the flower bed where these cicada killers have made their holes. And I've got about this much dust in here already. And I'm just going to reach down into that hole and get it as deep as I can and just poof dust down in there. I'm giving it six or eight good poofs. You can see the dust coming out now. So I know I got it all the way down in there. Now, this is a really good quick killer. But the drawback to this is if that hole gets watered because the sprinklers come on in the next few hours, we may miss killing those cicada killers because that dust is going to get soaked down further into the ground and may miss them. Usually this is best done after dark when everybody's home. We don't know if that particular cicada killer is home right now. So that's why this is better done, I believe, in early, early morning hours or after dark if possible. Usually where there's one, there's many. So we're going to show you a second way to give yourself a little more coverage. And you can do both, but you just don't do them in the same 12 hour period. The second way to treat cicada killers right around their mounds and in their holes is just to drench them. And in this two gallon uh, sprinkle can, which gives me a nice sprinkle action, which mimics rain, so they don't really get worn very well, uh, can give us good soak really quickly Make sure whatever product you choose to use um, is a petroleum base because it'll last longer underground. Usually we use permethrin or bifenthrin. This is permethrin. Check your label for the number of ounces per gallon. We're using an ounce and a half per gallon on this because they're big bodied. So you need more parts per million of your killing ingredient to kill those big guys. So we're just gonna soak all their holes. You can see the water flooding down into their hole. This is a really big one up here. We're just going to flood down in there. This is still also best done at night when they're probably home. But even when they come back later, if they're out busy killing cicadas right now, their home will be destroyed. And as they try to dig it out, this little tiny, it's really not much pesticide, but this little tiny bit of practically organic pesticide will still be in their, in their hole. And it will last long enough, so if the babies manage to hatch out of there, the larvae that they lay down in there, the eggs, they won't survive either. So this is really a good thorough way. This particular homeowner has a lot of beds in one area. As you can see, she has a big, beautiful flower bed area, so there was lots of happy places for these cicada killers. So it's a really great way to do multiple areas. You can see where that work dirt is. That's where their homes are. There's another one in here. You can't see the hole very well, but it's there and you can see all that dirt they threw up. So you soak it deep enough that you can see it running down into the tunnel and soaking down in. Now, side note, this is also a perfect way to take out a fire ant mound real fast. But with fire ant mounds, you, you go even deeper. I would have used double this amount if I were doing fire ant mounds because they dig so, so, so deep. So if you think you're having a problem with cicada killers or other ground wasps, send us a picture or come by the store with a picture and we'll instruct you on your particular situation so you can handle them quickly and efficiently.